I love you. Do you ever like clap to help sync your stuff? Nah. Huh. I just like making it as hard as possible. <laughs> Not this time. <laughs> I'm gonna unsync it. <laughs> Today's episode is sponsored by Squarespace. Well, I still have a bunch of unread emails from the last time that I reviewed your film camera collections. And it's not really like they're going anywhere. I can't just light them on fire and throw them into oncoming traffic like I did with Baxter's Poo. So today I'm here with Caleb and we're going to sift through some camera collections together. So we have to chug these. Oh my god. As part of uh, okay. my active protest. Chug? Oh my god. To bring Flaming hot? Dude. Do you have enough toilet paper for this? <laughs> I've been drinking one of these every day for Kodak to bring uh, air chrome back. Oh, they don't care about you. This doesn't even taste like Flaming Hot Cheetos. <clears throat> this isn't even Flaming Hot. I'm not happy about this. Just give it a give it a minute. It's Flaming Hot when it comes out your ass. <laughs> it contains zero percent juice. <laughs> Yo, yeah, you think they milked this from a plant and made a juice out of this? Who knows? The flaming hot Mountain Dew plant. What's the premise? What are we doing here? I forgot. I asked for people to send me a bunch of their right. camera collections and um, I got like way too many oh, yeah. emails. So we're just going to go through and okay. uh, check them out. All right, let's see. We got a good flat lay here. This is a cool collection. I dig this one. This is like half of my camera collection. You got the AE-1, the Pentax yep. 7 and the Makina. What do you think this is? That looks like a digital camera. It looks like a solar panel. You know what I actually really like is that handle. I was gonna say is that the handle is kind of it's kind of an interesting move. Mm. I don't know. I don't like it. I think the you don't? the X Man looks really cool blacked out. Do you want to try and pronounce this guy's name? So I can pronounce it. Alex Zaretsky. Oh well, it. yeah, because you clicked on the. F okay, so you got a what a Nikon F50. Someone recently in my latest video was like, "Bro, you need more Nikon's in your life." They're probably right. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. That was pretty funny. They have a Ooh. Smug Mug, uh, mug. They do have a Smug Mug Mug. If you do work for Smug Mug, can you tell them to uh, stop, stop logging me out every two days? <laughs> Notice me, Senpai. Okay. Okay, Yashika Flex. Oh, I really like the Nikon FM2. Those oh, yeah. are great cameras. Yeah. You can kind of see this guy's reflection down here. What if he was just like completely naked in the reflection? <laughs> Everybody <laughs> has TLRs for some reason. I could see that. I mean, they're easy. It's an easy thing to get, especially Yashikas. They're so cheap. Got the auto winder. Wonder if he doesn't use it just like you. The I want. You know what I wonder is when you pick up a Nikon FM2 and a Canon E81. Like, when would you pick up which one? You know what I don't like about this collection? You have mm. to commit across the board. They bought the like silver versions of most of the cameras, oh. except the AE1 here is the black version. That's more of like an interior decorating note. No is way. that not what this channel is? <laughs> I need water. I feel like I'm like, um, I feel like I'm on this new like, you know when you take drugs? No. Dude, the first time I chugged one of those, the aftertaste was like eggs. Isn't that weird? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then ever since, I haven't been able to taste anything. That's COVID, bro. Ooh, uh, some, some, it looks like someone needs a little TLC on that Polaroid down there. When your covering starts to like look like sh like that, yeah. it's like the perfect time to send it in to get it fixed because they have to remove the covering to fix it anyway. That's true. So like, you know, that, that Russian camera is super interesting. I have one in my collection, actually. Well, it's Greg's. Okay, 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 okay. The blacks on these photos are too dark, dog. Yeah, I can't, yeah. I can't yeah. make out any details. You gotta CC this thing. You gotta color correct. What lens does he have for that Minolta X700? I picked that up the other day thinking I should shoot it, and then I saw my Leica. Sounds like that happens to you a lot. <laughs> oh, it's a 28. 28. 28. Okay. 28. I was thinking about getting a new lens for it to see, see if that will rekindle my love with that camera. There's a Minolta 57 1.4 that's supposed to be pretty good. It's like super cheap. Hmm. Is it's it? got a lot of Because like, it's 57. Yeah. So like, shoots that. <laughs> oh, it's an EOS 1N. One one. So You're it is right. a 1N. I am right. I love this it. Too? They have a Zeiss lens. Yeah. Monitor. I thought you meant the cork M6. board. Yeah, the cork <laughs> dope, dude. The M6 is definitely taking the cake. It's I a. Like, is it a 50, though? Or is it a 35? Uh, you'd never be able to tell because the blacks are crushed <laughs> into a blue. Plain R52. I like it. This is solid. I think this one right here is probably the most solid so far. Okay, so you know what? I would have to say A plus for the effort of presentation. Someone maybe uh, is a YouTuber themselves because they have a blue microphone. Maybe it's they- It's white. Uh, okay, there's there's a good amount to look here. Okay, we got a Bessel, a Bessel. <laughs> a Bessa L, which is not a rangefinder technically. I guess, no, it is a rangefinder. Actually, is the L- There's no range... windows. You're right, so it's not a rangefinder. It's the um, it's the zone focus one. How decoration. 
fucking stupid is it that they have a Bessa and a Leica? <laughs> <laughs> also, hardcore side note, Lauren said that I should buy the MDA. <laughs> hey man, my girlfriend's telling me to buy another camera. Do I really have to say no? They, that's like a old school Zorky. Is that like the one you have? Yeah, well, Greg. Oh shit, is that a messed up um, SX70? I thought it was there? like a squished SX70. Is this a 4x5 or 8x10? I think that looks 4x5-ish. It's a big 4x5 Dude, I would camera. never take that out. Aw, that's that's cute. Okay, so I think I this, have to, this this this. <laughs> <laughs> you have to take a sh already. Let me just like swiggle a little bit. <laughs> yeah, around. I don't want to like diss anyone's collection too hard, but oh, are we supposed to be nice? I really like that strap on the Olympus up there. This isn't the strongest camera collection we've seen. We're also jaded. Okay, I, yeah, people are, are really digging on those Olympus OM1s, man. Didn't you say you you wanted to look into the OM1s? Yeah. Or something? Yeah, just because I'm, I, because I have a problem. Your problem is you don't have one. <laughs> you know what? Is that an old Leica? No, it's a Zorky. I get why they're popular, because they're definitely look like us for sure. I'm a snowboarder. I used to be when I was young. So you're used to drinking Mountain Dew. I was like, I need new boots, because these boots are terrible for me. And I'm sitting there looking at all these boots, and I'm like, I could get these, which are cheaper boots, but they do the job. Or I can get these really nice, really nice boots. And I'm like, Dad, I don't know which ones to get. And he's like, you know what? <laughs> you haven't even said the punchline yet. There's <laughs> no punchline. Get the expensive kind because they'll never wear out. Mm. How old are you? 12. They still fit. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Why did that... What? <laughs> what, I'm, that what, I, what, I, what I'm getting at is no Zorkies. I'm just looking at the tiny little thumbnail here. I feel like this strap is about to be really cool. You ready for this? Yeah. That's a cool strap. I'm going to say this is a pretty solid collection <laughs> other than... Yeah, this is actually a really solid collection. I disagree. I don't think it is a good collection. Leica M5, I think the M6 is better. Well duh. Mamiya 6, I think the M7 is better. Okay, so go ahead and defend this collection. <laughs> um, you committed too early. You know what? There's something about that, that M5 that looks really good right now, though. I think you just... You have like... You know how people get like baby fever? You just have that for Leica. <laughs> Would you ever think to yourself that you could own every Leica M body that came out? Like get an M2, M3. You'd probably get the Leica M5 last though, right? Do you want me to tell you the order I'd get it in? I know it. Leica, MD, I don't really know. Is M MDA is like, is that like a drug or something? MDMA. MDMA. I yeah. don't know that. Yeah. <laughs> $5 at a thrift store, nice. Everyone has Pentax 6.7s. Yeah, that's true. What is it about? Like, they're great cameras, don't they're get great. me wrong, but what is it about that camera that everyone has one? Maybe we should throw ours away. That'd be a little easier for you right now, wouldn't it? Yeah. Because it's great. broken? Yeah, it would be. Thanks. This is a good collection. It's pretty simple. Except for, I don't know, the, the Olympus, it's an XA2 instead of an XA. It's the weirdest thing. Olympus was like, oh yeah, here's the XA, and everyone's like, yes! And they're like, guess what? We're gonna make a <laughs> Your version. Review Flex, review. What the f is a review? I think it's like some off brand company. Is it like JCPenney? Yeah. <laughs> Except they probably didn't sell clothes. Does that how, what does that look like to you? <laughs> Silver Souls. Yeah. City oh, film. I've totally forgot to tell you. Someone hit me up that's like a US Silver Souls, basically. He got me because he's like, hey, I'm from Kansas. I'm like, <gasps> Did he tell that's you that? That's all it takes. Yeah. Did he say he's from Kansas? Well, they're in the Midwest, so I don't know. Yeah, but there's a lot of Midwest. <laughs> really? I thought it was just one state. <laughs> one bum-ass backcountry bum -ass. state. In a weird way, I like how that's raised. How the shutter speed dial is like raised You past. can just grip it easier. You can grip it a little easier. I like touching yeah. things easier. It's like a little nipple on top. <laughs> FC... FEC? FC... I like the Yashica T4. That's... Yeah. I love those cameras so much. You don't see Mamiya uh, 645 Pros a lot. Like, how many times have you seen yeah. that camera in a collection? Yeah. Here's my camera collection. Partially inspired by yours, like the Hassi, is currently undergoing a CLA. You didn't attach anything, my guy. Film camera collection featuring hot singles in your area. Wow. Okay. This is a lot to kind of this is dissect. A lot, to, a lot to take in. This seems like the type of person who would just like buy stuff and then regret it a month later, you know? <laughs> like us. I have to finish this by the end of this video. <gasps> oh, bro. I like a M6. Bro, bro, look right above it though. Another M6. Oh, shit. And a Hasselblad with three different backs. What do you do with three different, no, four backs. Personally, I would take away some points because the backs are mismatched. Sometimes you gotta mismatch in life, bro. No. I well, think I, I have a headache because of this. <laughs> 
good. I keep drinking. I'm really impressed uh, at the two different uh, like a M6s because um, that's my dream. You know, some people have like, they want to get married, get a house. I just want two like M6s. That's my dream in life. Veronica, okay, that's just solid. Veronica's are solid. If you could limit yourself to one medium format camera, that's humble. <laughs> it means I know what I like and I don't need anything else. Yeah. And I have true. a big nutsack. <laughs> My name is Joshua Banesh. I'm, I'm unfortunately from Florida. <laughs> <laughs> I like the Sekonic light meter though. Ooh, and you got an X700? Hell yeah. Have you ever thought about that? We at least started our photography journey, our film photography journey, when cameras weren't insane. Didn't you borrow this from someone for a while too? Greg, I still have it. Do you even own your Leica M6? <laughs> Ooh, okay, what do we got here? We got an Intrepid, I'm into that. Ooh, okay, okay, other than the Nikons, this is a great collection. F3s look super cool, but honestly, all things considered, I think the F2 is a better camera. Cause I think the F3 started to introduce like electronic shit. You know, the interesting thing here is we have, you know, we have two Nikons, and you got a 6.6, you have a 6.9, and then you have an Intrepid. Yeah, I'm surprised there's no 6.7 in there. Yeah. Okay, this guy says roast me, daddy, so let's roast. Roast? I guess like when you go out, which one do you choose? Because none of them seem like good options. That's like a old school, that's what they called a, uh, that was a pocket camera back in the day. Yeah, how big were their pockets, dude? I mean. Actually, I think really what it was is their inside pocket. So it could fit inside. They had to move all their like knives and <laughs> <laughs> Oop, M6. I like the, uh, the like blue and the orange on this. It's kind of oh, cool. Oh yeah, is that blue? Is that black? That's black. Yeah, it's black and gold. That does not look black and gold to me. Get your eyes checked, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> I think it's a good camera collection, except yeah. for the Holga. Well, you have one too, so. Do you think I'd ever be able to sell my Holga? Oh, probably, but not for like, for like a dollar. Bucks. <laughs> for like five dollars at a thrift shop. I hate that camera. Ooh, this is the first collection that is. Yeah, I could see myself making love to. <laughs> Very. Other than the, let's just hide those Nikon. I really don't like Nikon. <laughs> They just look like garbage I think they're cameras. an acquired taste, man. Yeah. I agree. I don't think these are the better looking Nikons. The F3 is okay, but I think the F2 is probably the best looking. Ugh. Skip. Pentax 645N. Just you're gonna, you had a you're going to be disappointed someday. What? I heard that. Don't you f***ing... Dude, you got so many emails. Yeah. They we could do like it. five of these. I'm gonna be milking this for the next like six years, dude. What do you think of the Nikon 28 Ti? Oh yeah, those are great. I mean, I don't know from first experience, but they look sexy AF. I'm really impressed by the Ricoh R1s. Good job. It's like clap. Those are uh, hidden gems for you? They're hidden gems. Maybe you watched my video, maybe you didn't. Maybe you got it on before yeah, I did, and if you did. Probably not. <laughs> All right, Roland. He's like- I love your bar of soap. <laughs> He's like uh, browsing Instagram while I was taking a dump. <laughs> he sees my story, like, send in your camera collection. He's like, perfect, they're right there. <laughs> Click. <laughs> uh, he does uh, have the same um, enlarger that I do. Yeah. That's cool. I'm getting enlarged just thinking about it. I used to have these uh, these speakers. Oh, yeah, what did you do with them? They blew out. Uh, I was playing well, too much. Uh, <laughs> four. I like this Genius. Mamiya NC100. It's, mm -hmm. it's kind of different. You don't see too many Mamiya like. Very you don't. You honestly really don't. I I I really do wonder how Mamiya glass is for 35. For 35, because you I don't. Sharp as balls. You don't. Frame. I'm just like I can't do. It. Ooh. Oh damn, a Bolex. Ooh. An old Bolly. What is going on with this? Rolly flex, dude. They got the like pistol grip, grip, and the prism finder and the flash. That's uh, I didn't even know half that shit existed for that thing. Before we go, I'd like to quickly thank today's sponsor, Squarespace. Are you a photographer with big aspirations of selling your prints and maybe even your photo books one day? Well then look no further than Squarespace. Squarespace is an all-in-one website building platform that allows you to customize your online presence to the fullest extent of your own creativity. With Squarespace's intuitive user interface, you can even build an online shop for all your selling needs and can easily manage shop tasks like managing inventory right from the dashboard. What's even better is that there are no plugins, patches, downloads, or updates you will ever need to install. Squarespace gives you all the tools and latest template options options right there for you to start building from. So what are you waiting for? If you're ready to build a website, you can start a free trial today at squarespace.com slash grainy days. And if you use the code grainy days at checkout, you can get 10% off your first purchase. Thanks for joining us uh, while we yeah, were reviewing yes. these cameras. We're going to go uh, watch some porn. I mean, browse eBay. Sound good? Yeah. Sounds good. Subscribe to Caleb's channel. <laughs> Um, okay.
Okay. I think we're recording. Okay. Um, but before I record, I well, I'm gonna put my phone on. Do not disturb.